It's been a year since I last posted a new tutorial on how to use Guido properly. Today, I'm going to show you how to use version 1.16.4 and its new feature, which lets you apply and revert settings automatically without using Guido. It's available on GitHub and FDroid, but I recommend GitHub since it's always up to date. As of now, it's on 1.16.4. Click Releases and choose the latest version. You can see that it's marked as latest. Download the APK file by clicking it. I'll use my mobile phone now to show you how to install Guido. Choose an app that has device settings restrictions. In my case, I'll choose Gcash since it doesn't let you use it when developer options is enabled. At the bottom, you can see five buttons. This one is for revert settings. This one is for add app setting. This one is for shortcuts. This one is for templates. This one is to launch the application. Let's choose templates to make things easier. As of now, I have added three settings that can help you. Let's choose High Developer Options and click the plus button on the left side. Now it's being added to Gcash. When you click the Android icon at the bottom, it will not launch Gcash yet. We need to grant the right secure settings first. There are ways to do it, but I'm going to use Shizuku and a shell. It's documented on Guido's GitHub page, so I'm not going to go in further details. Everything's done. Let's do it again. Gcash no longer warns me about developer options enabled since Guido already turned it off for us. Make sure to revert the settings back to their original values. As you can see, developer options is still intact. Now it warns me back since Guido reverted the settings to its original values. As of version 1.16.3 and later, I added a new feature where you don't need to click the launch icon inside Guido anymore.
It uses Usage Stats Manager to monitor in the background when an app is opened and closed. Make sure you grant Gita with Usage Access permission first. Now click the wavy circle to start the service. You can see this notification running. Let's try to open Gcash if it detects developer options enabled. Well, Guido does it again. This is for you lazy folks. Let's check developer options in settings if it's enabled. Guido's not lying to us. If you no longer needed Guido, you can stop the background service. That's it folks, please support me on my YouTube channel. Don't forget to star Guido on my GitHub, like and subscribe for more.